surrender to the Allies as of May 8, 1945. Gotten this world nowhere so far. <laughs> Germany was leading us in that war, and they still have all those weapons, still all that ammunition right there in Germany. Right there in Germany. They're not going anywhere. They're still there. We may have stopped them, but the weapons, we can't stop those. They're being produced and produced and produced until they just build up. Well, that is very right, I will say about that. But, um, I would like to also take all of their land as well as their arms. What say you, Winston? You know, it's you know, down a notch. I'm not. I'm not. Yeah, let's, let's slow down a little bit, fella. Anyway, what I was saying, gentlemen, is that we have to take their arms and their land. I absolutely disagree, sir. If you think I'm going to sit here in front of you people at this conference discussing the violation of basic government rights taking away the rights of the citizens and the military, then you are sorely mistaken. I'm glad that weirdo's gone. <laughs> and another thing! Are you kidding me? Are you serious? Do you really think this could work? And you... How would you feel if Germany tried to take away your arms, your tanks, your guns, your soldiers? You wouldn't like it much, would you? But it's okay, because it's happening to them, huh? You think civil peace isn't the way to solve this? You moron! You absolute buffoon! And you! Yes, you! You think it's okay to kill 60 million of your own citizens? And you want to disarm the Germans? Please, tell me how that's not hypocritical of you! You absolute idiot! You buffoon! I can't stand you or this entire conference! I'm leaving! Time. What is it to any of us? It's just a linear circle, a highway never ending with cars going both ways, past, present, future. If you speed it up, 
to the feet of light. Nothing's truly there. God. Omniscient. All-knowing. Transparent. Translucent. Everything. Everything we've always wanted to be. War. War. Everywhere. What does it really mean? The key piece emerges from the rubble, emerges from the fallen enemies, from the fall of brethren, from the dog tags with no names, the nameless soldiers, the ones who cook for us in our homes, the ones who breathe for us, our offspring for the future. Time, time is the key piece. Without time, there would be nothing. Without time, there would be no past, present, future. Without time, we, we wouldn't be here. Without time, we wouldn't have been here seconds ago, nanoseconds ago. The past is just a reflection of what just happened. The past is our mistakes, our present, our future. It is our future. Our past is our future. Our past relays information to the future. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? It is everything.